one coming up here. And there's another one going in, man. This is crazy. Woo! Oh, oh, there you go. And a bus. Everybody taking memories. It's amazing, you guys. Oh, bus. <laughs> man, this is amazing. This is so beautiful. I, I, I just want you to come here, man. I want to come close here. And people do memories, they write your names. Oh, look at that, man. them in South Africa and he's the guy behind yeah, yeah. He's the one the who allowed black people to drink as well. Alright guys, alright, alright. This is the Bay Bridge I told you about. This is the bridge. Bay Bridge. We are at the border. Actually, I'm still in Zimbabwe. Yeah, this is our face. I wanted to give you a walk right here on the Bait Bridge. The first security checkup. This is me, and we are heading to South Africa right now. So I'm gonna get my passport stamped over there. Welcome to South Africa. Yeah, I'm now leaving the Zimbabwe inside. I've got the stamp ready to get out of Zimbabwe and now I'm going to South Africa. What's up guys? Uh, welcome and welcome back to watch my video right here on your favorite channel. We are in Zimbabwe currently. We are in Zimbabwe. We are crossing the border, the Bay Bridge, the most busy border on the continent. This is crossing Zimbabwe and getting into South Africa. I hope you guys are going to enjoy this video. This is only about the experience. Mm -hmm. Nothing much, no hidden agendas, yeah, nothing guys. Just experience crossing the I'm Bay Bridge border into South, South Africa from Zimbabwe without okay, wasting guys, your time. Really Let's get right into the video because this video is crazy man. Let's get into it. Yeah guys, this is how it looks like to be in the middle of the Bait Bridge. This is how it looks like to be in the middle of Bait Bridge, which is the border between South Africa and Zimbabwe. Guys, I'm doing this video here by a very, very high risk. I've heard that uh, the Zimbabwean authorities don't want cameras around, so uh, please understand I'm trying to be a little bit discreet. That is what it is. Otherwise, no, this is just a pole of lights. And that is how it is right here. Right ahead of me is the Bait Bridge, the bridge itself. And there's gonna be a Limpopo River. <laughs> we still have to cross the last checkpoint from the Zimbabwean side yeah guys this is how I do my border crossing so for all of you who have questions this is how I do it otherwise let me know what you think in the comment section quite a beautiful border isn't it very smooth ah complicated things and this boat says welcome to Bay Bridge yeah guys that is Zimbabwe all of you asked me about how do I get to South Africa this is how I get 
I just play around the border, man. <laughs> I play around the border and just cross. Watch me pass, I'm telling you. But anyways, uh, let me tell you something, the truth. I do have my passport with me. Just wanna quickly show you. I do have my passport with me, guys, and I have all the stamps possible from Zimbabwe and South Africa. They are all here, man. Yeah, that's what it is. Stay tuned, let me update you more. If you've been to this border post, let me know in the comment section. Um, yeah, tell us about your experience. Are you a vlogger? Did you actually shoot videos here? Let me know. It's crazy, man. It sounds really crazy. I've heard that Zimbabwean authorities don't want people to shoot videos at their government facilities. So, and I guess this is one of them. So, I just really try to be discreet as possible as I can. But it's a long walk from the Zimbabwe immigration to South Africa. Ahead of me, we're gonna cross the bridge, the Bait Bridge. This border is called Bait Bridge after the the bridge that we're gonna find just right ahead of us before the last immigration, I mean the last security post from the Zimbabwean side. And we're gonna get to see the river there, the Limpopo River, the one full of crocodiles. <laughs> I've heard so many people cross this border via uh, other means, but it's not safe, guys. It's not safe. It's not safe. Just do the right thing and get yourself uh, the required papers so you can cross properly. Yeah. So that's what it is. Stay tuned. Let's walk. So people normally go to Msina and come back from Zimbabwe. Um, so. I guess uh, it's an open. I don't know where the Zimbabwean permit stands. Um, I've got no idea, but otherwise, let us know. Maybe I should get some water here. Ten rand only. Ten rand? Yes. Ah, five hundred. Wow, I just found out today is Africa Day, guys, and in Zimbabwe it's a very serious holiday. <laughs> very serious holiday so uh children didn't go to school no so it's just a holiday like other holidays anyway um i guess this is where the bait bridge starts guys we're gonna have to drop the video right because i see soldiers there and we don't want to be caught filming i hope you guys understand we resume after passing the soldiers you can see there their position and, uh, but if I have to check on this side, you see there are trucks crossing. This is a Zimbabwean site. Until we pass these soldiers, we will be in the no man's land. Mm. All right, guys. All right, all right. This is the Bay Bridge I told you about. This is the bridge, Bay Bridge. We are at the border. Actually, I'm still in Zimbabwe. That's a beautiful view, isn't it? Woo, that's so big, man. There's a lot of cro crocodiles ahead in this river. Hey, man. This is the other river that people pass, cross using they are trying to dodge from Zimbabwe to South Africa. Ah, man. It's too tight here. Yeah? And if you are here, you must have finalized, formalized, I mean, your passport and your visa. Then you can pass here. Look at that truck. That truck is going to Zimbabwe. That's the road for trucks and cars. And here is the pedestrian. This is how it looks like. Crazy, isn't it? That's the other side. This river is called the Mpopo, the Mpopo River. Mm -hmm. 
Really? Yeah. 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 Feeling so good, feeling at home, crossing from one home to another. I'm leaving Zimbabwe now. I would love to believe I'm almost in the middle of Zimbabwe and South Africa. Wow. Yeah. This is our face. I wanted to give you a walk right here on the Bait Bridge. This is the actual Bait Bridge you hear about all the time. Bait Bridge. You know? The our most busy border, I guess, in Africa. <laughs> I know last time I said about Kasumba Lesa. That's how it feels like. But if you go on papers, this bait bridge is much busier. So let me know what you think. Be the judges. <laughs> Mm. This is amazing. I just wanted to give you a walk here on the real bridge, the bay bridge, here on the border sides. Right now, I think we are in South Africa. I would love to believe, or oh, unless we cross the police, the security personnel from South Africa, then we can. Then we are in South Africa. Maybe we should call this area a no man's land. Very so strong. Gotta be here for years. And that this is the tallest bridge I've ever seen. Maybe um, a long time ago when I passed the Zambezi River in uh, um, Mozambique. Maybe it's long, I don't know. Not so sure. I don't want to confirm that. But if you think. There is a longer bridge than this. Let us know in the comments section which one do you think it is the longest bridge in Africa? Yeah, that's what it is, you guys. We are approaching. We are approaching now. The South African side of the border post. I think after this bridge, right at the end of this bridge, there's gonna be South African security personnel. But otherwise, you guys, it's amazing. If something gets lost here, if this camera falls, that other side, we might not have. To recover it might be cost so much. As it is, the bait bridge.
Let me know what you think, you guys. Let me know what you think. Look at that bridge. So long, man. So long. That bridge is so long. Look. Could be maybe about maybe 100 meters. Just measuring with my eyes, maybe 100 meters. Last time I was at the Botswana border, it didn't look. This doesn't look busier than that one. But otherwise, you guys, yeah. all these people you see here are Zimbabwean coming from South Africa, going to going back to Zimbabwe. Yeah. Security personnel got to go off. Okay, right now we passed the first security checkup. We just check your passport if you have a visa, I guess. Then you you just pass. It's very smooth. It's very smooth. I'm almost in South Africa. If you you can see a boat there, it says welcome to South Africa. So yeah, this is where I pass guys when I come into South Africa. So don't get confused, I guess, I guess uh, many of you will be answered. I don't jump borders, I'm not illegal in South Africa. Yeah, this is me and we are heading to South Africa right now. So I'm gonna get my passport stamped over there and uh, we proceed i will show you again once i'm on the other side yeah so that is south africa welcome to the republic of south africa stay tuned with us i'll be back the soonest yeah these are african brothers hustlers ah, everything is everything is going to zim Everything is just going to Zim from South Africa. It's amazing. This is the boat, you guys. Welcome to South Africa. As you guys can see. There you are. Welcome to South Africa. Ooh. Yeah, that's the second security check. We're gonna have to drop the video right here. Okay, I'll be back. Yeah, I just passed the security check. I just passed the security check. There is South Africa and now um, all travelers entering South Africa must proceed to the customs. And I guess it's this way. This is oncoming, this is going. Yeah, guys, it's amazing. <laughs> Yeah, it's amazing. It's amazing. Just uh, walking. This is the long walk to the. <laughs> Normally they say long walk to freedom, but this one is a long walk to the immigration offices. <laughs> so I've already stamped my exit from Zimbabwe. The only left now is entry into South Africa. I will let you know guys but otherwise I am already in South Africa I just have to report myself yeah. to the immigration offices otherwise those are the trucks leaving South Africa to Zimbabwe one of the things I realize here is that people are just carrying every single thing these are informal traders that cannot afford to pay for trucks to get their loads into the other side of the border and they actually just carry and carry so i believe every day is like this 
Let me know, maybe today is better. Look at you, Eric, but if you buy that, you buy that, because you're both in. TMJ Group. That truck is coming. Could be coming from whatever. Could be coming from. Zimbabwe could be coming from DRC anyway. Yeah man, this is a I think this is the biggest port of entry um on the land land uh part, part of entry. What do you call it again? There's a term that they, they say is uh, like offshore or something. <laughs> uh let me know guys, let me know, let me know, let me know. So drop, drop it in the comment section, let me know. There's this uh this is the biggest uh I think border post uh in South Africa, Bait Bridge. As you guys know, mostly Zimbabwe now rely on South Africa for almost everything. From food to ev man, everything. You guys can see. Ooh. Okay. Long walk. It could be like maybe a hundred or two hundred meters from the actual bridge to the immigration on the um, on the South African side. This is it. This is how the fences are. I don't know. At that side, I think it's just both South Africa side yes we are already in South Africa just wanted to show you how crossing the border feels like fortunately we can't really be shooting every single thing for security reasons for safety reasons uh, once we get closer to you. officials or the immigrations of police we Turn down the camera, but I don't cross. I didn't cross actually uh, 10 meters without showing you from when I started the video. Otherwise, if you got anything in mind, you wanna advise, let us know in the comment section. There is immigration departure pack home, so we are now. In South Africa, and we're, not, we're gonna go through the immigration offices now. I guess we're gonna get inside, not this one. This one, I think, is catered for the Zimbabweans. It's a departure home. I guess. Guys, this is the immigration side and I have to drop the, the video right now. Uh, yeah guys, we are now outside. We are already in South Africa. We already got the stand for entry. And that is us for me now. I'm going to the checkpoint. Um, I guess the police will check me oh. yeah guys so this is it I got the opportunity to walk around this is the very first checkpoint if you are coming uh, from South Africa you're going to Zim this is where you can actually get without any uh, stamps and now I'm just gonna walk. I'm good. I'm gonna just walk around. Show you guys these trucks are going to Zim. Eh? You are inside the car. You are asking me why I'm shooting here. Ah, uh, you were now. <laughs> so yes, guys, 
This is it. Bed bridge. We get problems, we get issues with people. much for watching this video let me know what you think uh, right in the comment section tell me guys what do you think about Bait Bridge what do you see man African uh, Africans are just hustling they hustle us you see those Zimbabweans carrying loads man on their heads man so crazy yeah otherwise this is this South Africa nobody shows you you better consider subscribing to this channel because you don't want to miss more videos like this What's up, what's up, beautiful people? Thank you so much for coming through to watch your video right here. Imani Nigaze for Perfect Africa, right again. Man, where we are now, man. I told you I'll take you places you've never been to before. Look at this. This is another touristic area. You're coming from Zimbabwe. I'm coming from Zimbabwe, you guys. So I thought uh, uh, you will definitely like it if I show it to you here, guys. This is amazingly how they pissed this mountain to make a road here. This is the Limpopo tunnels. There are actually two tunnels. There's that, that one here. And there is another one there. It's like you come you can like get out of the the, the the mountain. As you can see, it's just stony mountain. This is real stone. Uh you can like get out of the the mountain and like you, you you coming out but then you see this empty space here 
then you enter another one. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. This is a small river here. Without further ado, I think I should just take you to this side to show you exactly what I'm talking about. It's amazing. It just was coming from Zimbabwe. I showed you how I crossed the border, guys. It's so easy. I think this part of Africa is trying to really make it easy for Africans to, you know, to cross border. Uh, once you come here, you find these guys right here. They're busy taking pictures. Uh, it's a touristic place. If you are coming from from Africa, I'll say, then you get to this place. You're gonna love it. This is Kendrick for Fort Tanas. Hey, well, guys, can somebody read me here? I can't read. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can you read me that, that one? Okay. Hey, Hendrik Vervoet. Hendrik Vervoet? Yeah. Whoa, what, what, what is he? What did he do? Yeah. What did he do? Is, is he a guy or something? Uh, it's something like a... Oh, I'm a minister. He was, oh, a, minister, that he one. was a minister. Yeah. Okay. Then I was on a plane already with your time. Oh. Good food. We're not telling those are three. Yeah. That this surname, name. Okay. What there, are, what? there are three. Yeah, I, I see this one and that one. Ah, uh, I mean this one is in T. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's considered one. From another mini. Let's go in language and let me. What is this? That's the word Oh, it's the same guy, no? It's the same. Oh, it's the same. It's the same. So this, this guy, I will, I will say he was an engineer yeah, who yeah, prints yeah, this yeah. tunnel. So there's a couple of them in South Africa and he's the guy behind all yeah, of them. He's the one who allows the black people to drink alcohol. He's the guy who allowed black people to drink alcohol. Yeah, he's the one who allowed the black person to drink alcohol. Because long, long ago we were not allowed to drink beer. We were allowed to drink a very, what's a traditional uh, Yeah, Kumbu. Yeah. So if you have got the house, down there when you are going. Yeah. yeah. Two kilometers there is a, a downward, a nice one, double school. Okay. So there's a place for... for, for so it's a touristic place where you can come and visit. Uh, uh, like, it is, it's like a special doctor place because now he's dead. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. he's uh, obviously yeah, there. Uh, oh, 19, 1961. Yeah. When this thing was, was, was made, yeah. All the, the towers are very on up. And then I heard one of the one of you guys says there's a python here. Yeah, yeah the python. Can I? You can say you can see it while you are coming with the car outside to the tunnel. You can see the python, the biggest. Is it big? Yeah, big. Yeah, okay, like it lives there. Yeah, yeah. Oh man. <laughs> but let's okay, go guys. I'm so scared of, the, of snakes, but I think this one, if I get a chance to see it, I will definitely do. I uh, man. Okay, Bala, look at that man. I just want to show you how it looks like. Yeah, it's amazing. It's beautiful. I mean, yeah. The Python is here. Wow. Yeah, guys, I'm here. I'm here showing you these uh, tunnels. Yeah, a lot of people come here and uh, they don't miss to take pictures. They are guys who. You, you say, what's your name? You are a photographer, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, what's your name? So people will come here and you know they will look for you and maybe you can take them photos for yeah, memory. Rendani, ra, rendani Mdao. Rendani Mdao. Yeah. Please drop your, your your cell phone numbers. How do they connect you? How do they call uh, you? It's red one. Eh? Yeah. Eight six one. Yeah. Seven seven two eight. Yeah. You see it down there. Oh my goodness. Okay. 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 Yeah. But there's no python. Uh -huh. Oh! Look at that, guys. That's beautiful, eh? Oh, yeah, like there's a small waterfall there. Okay. Oh, there's a truck coming up here. And there's another one going in, man. This is crazy. Woo! Oh, oh, there you go. <laughs> Bus. Everybody taking memories. It's amazing, you guys. Oh, bus! <laughs> man, this is amazing. This is so beautiful. I, I, I just want you to come here, man. I want to come close here. And people do memories. They write their names for memories. Hello. It's, it's, it's un 
unbelievable. So that's it. Your guys right here. I'm taking you to Africa. Please, will you come with me? Just let me know in the comment section. And when you do that, please consider subscribing to the channel. Give this video, this video a big thumbs up. Just like it. It doesn't cost you a thing. And uh, yeah, Africa to the world. I hope you guys enjoy the video. And if you do, let me know. And give this video a big thumbs up. Uh, man, just drop a comment, man. You can also share this video with anybody that you feel like they wish to see this amazing architecture here oh man this is amazing this is beautiful thank you so much for coming to watch my video man i wish you all were here but <laughs>